Here we have the F-250 again and we're going to be replacing these side mirror lens caps and bulbs. So we're going to be putting LED bulbs in here, removing the stock halogen ones and putting these nice uh, lens caps in there. So you got to start by moving your mirror. So now let me see if I can get the reflection right. There we go. So you're going to want to move the mirror in towards you and then I already started clicking and then up so that's about as much as it's going to do yeah good all right so once you have it in this position you're going to be able to see this white tab here in the back and your color might differ if you don't have the original lens in there but you're going to want to push this tab back so kind of push it back and uh, away towards, towards the front of the truck. So you kind of push it out and out comes the lens. And then after that, just twist counterclockwise on both bulbs to get them out. And remember the orientation. Uh, this top one is your turn signal bulb. Come on. And then the bottom one is your running light. There we go. And again, we're going to be using the JBM Ember LED bulbs. So non-polarized, so just kind of put them in there. And I have noticed something. These O-rings tend to tear. So you can take your caliper and measure them. And I'm going to do that for you guys so that we can go ahead and buy them if they're all posted up. See this guy. This one's already kind of broken, so you can see see how it's all cracked up. So this guy is a looks like a three millimeter on there by the three mil three millimeter thickness. It's thirteen millimeter somewhere around there. So try to get something that's close to that three millimeter by. 13 millimeter diameter. So, put this guy back in just for now till we get the new O ring on here. Uh, you don't want to run them without them because uh, your housing will not be waterproof. Kind of put this guy back in. Twist clockwise. And if you try and put the bulb in a, in the socket and it doesn't stay in there, you're probably missing the O-ring. You have to get a new one. So get that in there. Now that it's in, all you have to do is just put it back in there. Click in place. There we go. Now unlock this and let's look at those lights on there. Yep. So it's that easy.